Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has rolled out a beta channel inside a build for this week, starting the 28th of November. And this latest inside a preview build, 22635.2776, is made available with the latest update to the beta channel, KB5032292. Now, if you are interested, just a quick video to go through a couple of changes and improvements that Microsoft has made available to the beta channel this week. Not too much really going on, but nonetheless, there are a couple of improvements that are being gradually rolled out uh, to the beta channel insiders who have the get the latest updates as soon as they're available toggle turned on. So the first is regarding Windows Share. And Microsoft says that if you are signed in with a Microsoft Enter ID, in addition to being able to share to your Microsoft Teams, that's work or school contacts, you can also now share directly to specific Microsoft Teams channels and groups chats as well as directly within the Windows Share window. So if you are using Windows Share, that may be a nice move in the right direction. Now, the next change and improvement that's been gradually rolled out, if you have that toggle turned on, is regarding Windows Inc. And I'm just going to mention um, this next uh, improvement. Windows Inc. now supports, according to Microsoft, digital handwriting in edit boxes in multiple languages and locales, which are locations, making communicating with thoughts and ideas easier. So there's quite a few locations that have been added to um, Windows Inc., with the ability to use digital handwriting in some edit boxes for Windows Inc. And as mentioned, that's rolling out now to numerous locations. And then the task manager, they've improved the process grouping in the process page for task manager. So that's a small little, basically a UI improvement for the task manager, which is always a good thing because task manager is one of those legacy components that has been around um, in Windows basically forever. And then the fixes that have been gradually rolled out to the beta channel include two for task view. So task view has uh, received two fixes. They fixed an issue that made the desktop tooltips in task view hard to read in contrast themes. And the second is they also fixed an issue when dragging and dropping windows in task view to different desktops. Apparently that was... Um, causing the window to unexpectedly place the window in the background of other windows. So those are two task view fixes that have rolled out. And then just going to mention the next is for live captions. They also fixed an issue that was causing live captions to sometimes show the same line of text twice. And then we've also got a change and an improvement that's been gradually rolled out to everyone uh, in the beta channel. And this is regarding the... Uh, the home page for uh, the beta channel uh, in the settings. And this update apparently starts the rollout of account related notifications for Microsoft accounts on the settings home page. And home page has already started rolling out as mentioned with the uh, moment four and 23H2 feature updates to the stable channel. And if you wanna manage um, these account related notifications, you can just head over to uh, your privacy and security in settings, head over to the general uh, section and you can turn some of those uh, notifications on and off from this page if you would be interested. And that's more or less, guys, what's rolled out um, to the Beta Channel Insiders for this week. As mentioned, with and as mentioned previously, with the rollout of Moment 4, the Moment 4 feature update in 23H2 to the stable channel, there's not too much happening in the Beta Channel. And that's the Windows 11 Insider Preview Build, 22635.2776 update KB5032292 that rolled out late on the 28th of November in my region. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.